Hello, my name is Jesse, and today I'll be showing you how to use Nagios as a security tool when it comes to website defacement. Many organizations would like to use Nagios XI as a sort of security tool to check for website defacement to make sure that websites maintain their original content. So we've built in a wizard that will do this automatically for you. The domain that we're going to be checking against, or the website rather, is example.com, and I've pulled up the source code of example.com here. So let's actually just check for this string, Helvetica new. So we know that if Helvetica new changes, then our website perhaps has been defaced. In your own organization, this might be a more elaborate string, maybe some sort of secret key, or perhaps a piece of code that is very critical to your infrastructure. So we'll go back to Nagios XI, go to Configure, Configuration Wizards. Let's type in Website, and we're going to click on the Website Monitoring Wizard. So once here, we'll enter the domain that we're checking against, or the fully qualified domain name of the website. This is going to be http colon slash slash example.com. Press Next. And now let's grab that snippet of source code once more, Helvetica New. We'll click Copy, go back to XI, scroll down. And what we'll do is actually untick these website-related services. You know, these will ping the website, make sure that HTTP is up and whatnot. In this case, we're just going to be checking for defacement. In your case, you may want to leave these services on. So we'll click, well, we'll check the radio button next to web page content, and we'll enter our string, Helvetica new, next to content string to expect. So this content is expected in the source code. And I'll press next and finish. Once this finishes, Nagios XI will have generated a host and an appropriate service for checking that web page's content. Let's type in example to find example.com. Once at example.com, we'll check on web page content and force this check to happen now. We can see that it's in a pending state, and now it's in an OK state, meaning that Helvetica new has been found in the source code of this website. Even though that the, uh, the original website document listed here doesn't say Helvetica new, our website configuration wizard doesn't just check what you see on the website, it does indeed check the source code. And that's how you go about monitoring for website defacement using Nagios XI. If you have any questions about that process, please feel free to reach out to us at the support forum. We're always at support.nagios.com forum. Otherwise, feel free to check out our related content at the YouTube channel. Thanks.